Hey, guys, welcome back to this piece of shit game. Let's, yeah, let's relive the horror. And, uh, let's, let's load up this file. This is about where we left off. Yeah, check it out. This is my Mike character file. You might notice that the screen is kind of off-centered and, and shit. You might wonder what's up with that. And, uh... Yeah, we, we read that last time, I think. I don't know. Uh, basically, I'm invisible. This is the glitch I was telling you about last time. That basically breaks the game. And, uh... Yeah, you might not think there's much to it. Because, you know, you can use her... To kind of give an idea of where your location is. But, uh, yeah. That, that's all well and good and all. Until you get into this next area where things kind of become a little more difficult as we're introduced to the final enemy type. Say hello to the demonic purple warthogs. Yes. Yes, your worst fears come to life. Blue, purple, pigs with tusks on two legs. Truly, God has never known such horrors in creative imagination. I'm but, but seriously, yeah, I just electrocuted it because I walked into it. I, oh, and ain't that, that's, that's not cheap. Yeah, that's not cheap at all. That's, that's perfectly good game. Oh, good. Yeah, I want to get clustered in. You fucking, no, fuck this, fuck this. We're, we're not even going to bother. We're not even going to bother going that far into it. Let's just get this piece of shit out of the way. Bring back Billy. Okay, yeah, say hello to Billy again. Yeah. Let's, yeah, let's read this again, just, just for uh, shits and giggles, because this is the final puzzle here. And, you know, we need crystals, and, uh, and bullshit. And this is telling us that the two statues on the ends are not going to be any good. We don't want to put crystals in those. And, uh, there's one to one of their left. Of course, if the one on the left is on the end, the, basically the middle one, one to the left of the middle one is what we need to and so yeah let's let's just go do that get that the fuck out of the way if you know what I'm saying I know what I'm saying I'm saying I'm ready to get this game over with are you ready yo you've been ready Billy I know you yes and what's the name of that bitch again I, uh, Jessica or something I don't know these characters are just so memorable that I have a hard time remembering her name, because I don't want to get too attached for when the journey is over. Okay, I kind of fucked myself over there. No, no biggie. No biggie. No biggie. Big whammy. Big... Okay, good. It's just... Yeah. Yeah, please. Block me in. Block me in. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Knife that fucker. Knife that fucker. Okay, we're just gonna go over here now. Because apparently... I'm cursed, and uh, I set myself up for bullshit. Yeah, I have set myself up for all sorts of bullshit here. Hells to the yeah, hells to the yeah. Can you say hells to the yeah? I said hells to the yeah. That is what we got to go with. Slang, and I need to go over here because, of course, I need this piece of bullshit crystal over here for the puzzle. And you might wonder where the puzzle's located at. Oh, you can rest assured it's in a room full of these fuckers. What room? You might ask this room. One that says that's your room. Okay. You. I will put the crystal in you. I will wait for Warthog to step away so I can do that. There we go. Okay, whoa. Hey, now. Yo, what's up? Pull that lever. I don't know what happens if you get it wrong. I, I would imagine you probably die. I would imagine you probably die. Alright, we're at the core. And, uh, yeah, this is going to be more dialogue, story, whatever. You know, it's boring as hell. And we get a choice here. We can either split up or do pass and turn. You might think doing this one will make the game twice as long. It doesn't. Because, uh, you end up doing one path, and, uh, the other one's just... Both the same bullshit. It just affects whether the bitch lives or dies. I, I guess she can live. The choice...
choice earlier in the game with the staying with that one dude. I said it didn't matter. I, it turns out I was wrong. And we'll see that later. But first we gotta do this. Let's hope I don't die. Alright, so we just need to get by Warthogs again. Okay, I, I just totally stabbed and got bit by a Warthog at the same instant. That's proper execution of defensive items and whatnot. Okay, I'm just gonna walk this way then. Fuck you. Okay, I'm not gonna walk that way. Excuse me, I gotta cough. <coughs> yeah, because I'm on the edge of my seat here. This is just... I can't take no more. Set up this fang. We're done here. Let's try the other path, she says, which we will. Now you have to be quick on this part, otherwise you won't get through. And you'll get fucked over and have to leave and then come back out because the enemy set up in this room is fucking bullshit. Who would have thought warthogs from hell could be so cheap? Or is this hell? Uh, spoilers? No, it's not. I don't know what this place is. It's like we jumped through the Stargate, but instead of gay Egyptians, we've got this. Alright, I hope you're ready for the end game. Yeah, it's just, see, it's doing it automatically. And uh, here we go. Yeah. dragon. And why are we trying to talk to the dragon? Because the dragon can talk. Yes, this enemy talks. And a lot. Oh my god, does it talk a lot. It apparently has a name and an origin story, which it's going to tell you right now. Yeah, you know, god forbid there be any mystery to this alternate dimension. That would just kind of at least give this game some kind of, <coughs> pardon me, <laughs> mystery. <laughs> but no, no, this guy, he, oh, Exposition King. Exposition King, yes. He is conqueror of everything and destroyer of all, and, and, uh, you know, he says he can't help it. Has a college degree and uh, ability to communicate. Show sentience, but no, no control. That, that that makes perfect sense. Also, by the way, Doctor who died in last video, he's apparently alive. And, uh, oh, yeah, here you go. This is going to be great. I, I hope you're ready for this. This game is so awesome. This game is so awesome that it even has to fuck Billy out of his, you know, final battle. No, instead this asshole doctor gets to fight this dude. And, uh, yeah, this time we're actually gonna have to run around some more. Oh, by the way, yeah, they thought this game mechanic was so good they had to do it twice. This waiting a minute and a half to fucking shoot something by stepping into it. But, yeah, uh, yeah, Billy don't get to fight this guy. This, uh, dragon whatever thing. No, it's... It's a fat white dude with a mustache and a lab coat. Yeah, this is epic. This is the epitome of boring. What the hell am I doing with this game? Who, who made this? <coughs> oh man, I feel like I'm catching a disease by playing this. Or something. I don't even know where to begin on how much this sucks. Also, can you imagine trying to do this invisible? Oh, the, now you see why I couldn't beat the game before. But yeah, apparently if you make that one decision, excuse me, I need to go into my inventory and, and heal up. If, if you leave that guy behind earlier, he, he dies, and then you do have to, to play this as uh, Billy, Mike, Joel, whatever the fuck you want to name your character. I don't know if there's any really big differences between... Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to talk over the action. I'm sorry. 
Well, of course, her name was on the front. Scenario, dark guy. Well, I'm... Sure, surely the event programming wasn't... Oh, it is. It is. Was it Dark Gaia? Oh no, it's someone else. Someone else's. Multiple people. I'm turning this fucking music down. Fuck that. Are they going to credit Capcom or Konami? Because they should. For some of this music. What did you do to the menu? I thought that was RP me. You didn't do shit to the menu. You gotta be fucking kidding me. And there was a manual for this game? I didn't know about it. Nice way to plug that font.com. I'm sure they really wanted their URL in this game. Look at all the people who worked on graphics. How many fuckers does it take to recolor sprites that came included with this thing? Whatever. Okay, good. They did cap... They did... Yeah, they, they credited them. I'm sure Konami and Capcom are very proud to be included in this. Oh, get a load of this. Get a load of how many beta testers there were for this thing. And this is still the final result. Oh my god. Check out the last letters on, on these last four people's names. They spell Zoom. Zoom! Wanna get the fuck out of here is why it goes like that. Don't credit me. Make this shit scroll faster. I don't want to be on here. Whatever. So yeah, that was one night. And that was the end. And they did actually make two sequels to this. I, I can't imagine actually doing those. Because you know there's no way they're going to be any fucking better. Yeah, final statistics. I, I think I 100% ran this game. That's that's fun. That was not fun, actually. No, I'm, I'm exiting out. Fuck that. I'm black screen. That's the best part of the game, when you close it. Actually, uninstalling it would be the best part of the game. I might do that. I don't know. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed One Night. That was an epic masterpiece, wasn't it? I, I, yes. The best. The best! <laughs> oh, man. I need to pick better games. I really do. I really fucking do. That was shit. Although I'm glad someone suggested it. I, you know, no, no. I don't mind that. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying. I should have showed better judgment. I should have. See you next time. Bye.